Today we'll be adding a micro soldering station to our workbench. I recently bought this micro soldering pen from online and as you can see it comes with an extra soldering tip. I got a female connector to which this pin can be connected. This micro soldering station is powered from 12 volts. Hence, I'll be using the 12 volts power supply from the SMPS fixed on my workbench. These are the connections to the pin of soldering iron. I have connected the 12 volts power supply to the soldering iron. Now let's see if this works. As you can see, the soldering iron is melting the solder and it's working fine. I will be connecting the female connector of soldering iron here. I have already drilled a hole and I will be fixing this female connector using a washer. Next I'll be connecting 12 volts power supply to this pin through one of the switches. I'm drilling a hole beside this pin to add an LED which will act as an indicator. Here I have connected the 12 volts power supply to the pin through this switch. I have used an extra metal plate here to hold the pin firmly. I have connected the LED and the 12 volts power supply from the SMPS through the switch to the pin like this. The LED is connected to this with a series resistor to limit the current. As you can see the LED is lighting up, now let's connect the soldering iron and see if it works. As you can see the soldering iron is working quite well. As of now I have made uh, the soldering iron temperature constant and in future I will probably make a circuit which can vary the temperature of the soldering iron. So that's all for today. If you like this video you might like some of my other videos too. Please check them out at uh, Electronics Made Easy Khadar. I will see you in my next video. Thank you.